remains a priority. Uh, next would be uh, making sure that the easing of the MCO will result in uh, uh, faster rate of economic growth. Q4, as I said, uh, because of October and, and November, numbers are going to be quite bad. Yeah? Uh, therefore, uh, in the, in the, certainly in the second half of December, we hope that things will, will perk up a bit uh, and that will begin the process of uh, gradual economic recovery. And the news we've been hearing from UK, yeah, uh, the lady who, who was vaccinated, uh, you know, uh, COVID, uh, we believe that that will uh, send uh, a good signal throughout the world uh, that things are beginning to look better. That will be good for the Malaysian economy as well. It certainly injects a lot of optimism, the yes, story about the vaccine certainly in the UK. a bit more optimism. I wouldn't yes. say that we, we are very optimistic <laughs> yes. because uh, yeah. we know that there's some distribution issues. We're not mm -hmm. too sure when mm -hmm. the vaccine is going to land on our shores.